For the first time ever, there is now an auxiliary bishop serving the Rio Grande Valley. CBS 4's Priscilla Estrada was there as hundreds of Valley residents gathered to watch the Episcopal ordination. <laughs> It was an ordination ceremony. Hundreds wanted to witness firsthand. It's a, it's a privilege to be able to serve the church, you know, because that's what it is. It's more than an honor. With over 20 years serving the Diocese of Brownsville in an emotional sacramental ritual, Mario Alberto Avilas became the first ever auxiliary bishop to serve the Rio Grande Valley Thursday night. I made a petition to the Pope and said, Okay, basically described to him that because of the size of the diocese and its growing uh, Catholic population and the and the uh, and the and the the hopes that we have for development in the future that an auxiliary bishop would be a great service to the building up of the faith. The Diocese of Brownsville serves over one million Catholics throughout 71 parishes in the Rio Grande Valley. Holy Father Pope Francis, uh, you know, gave me the news about my appointment. Appointment is, uh, I think, it was a lot of excitement and but also. Uh, being ready to, to serve the people in the valley. And With numbers rapidly growing, the diocese needed Bishop Avilas to assist Bishop Flores meet the pastoral and administrative needs of the diocese. Now, the diocese wants to expand efforts with the extra help on the table. Uh, of making the church present, especially in the in the peripheries, the more the more rural and perhaps uh, the colonias where a lot of people who are very, um, who have different, well, they lack resources, um, and community building because the presence of the church is a very important part of the spiritual life and the development of a community. In San Juan with Complete Valley coverage, Priscilla Estrada, CBS4 Valley, tonight.